Seen you since I was sitting here, boy. It's, that's Looks right. Good to see say, is uh, Mahatma here, G here today? Yes, he's here today. Uh, well, look, how do you think his chances? Is there any chance of getting a little talking picture of him? We got all our sound equipment. Right. Talking picture? Yeah. You get all the sound equipment right here in the truck. Bring us, bring us up in, Anthony. Right in here. Hurry up, not load it now. You want a talkie of him? Yeah, we want to get a talkie of him. Well, Mr. Danny is one of the most difficult subjects in the world for talking. He has a very feeble voice. And moreover, he has a very deep prejudice against being photographed at all. If England does not uh, grant uh, your demands, what course of action will you follow then? Of course. Civil disobedience and all other phases of the Tiagra are always at our disposal, but whether we shall resort to these, this weapon immediately or what other steps we shall take, I cannot judge at present. If England uh, grants your demands, Mr. Gandhi, uh, do you intend to have complete prohibition in the new Indian state? Oh, yes. Absolute prohibition? Absolute. And do you intend also, if India wins its independence, to abolish child marriages? I should very much like to even before. Do you expect England this time will uh, give India full self-government? That also is more than I can say. But you are hopeful. I am an optimist. You are an optimist. If you go to the second round table conference, uh, will you go attired in native Indian dress or will you prefer European dress? I should certainly not be found in European dress. And if the weather permitted, I should uh, present myself exactly as I am today. Yes. And if the King of England invited you to uh, dinner at Buckingham Palace, you would go in your customary Indian dress. In any other dress, dress I should be uh, most discourteous to him, yes. because I should be artificial. If England does not grant your demand, are you prepared to return to jail again? I am always prepared to return to David. <laughs> uh, would you be prepared to die in the cause of India's independence? Well, it is a bad question. <laughs> <laughs> 